Groundbreaking news concerning St. John's County. After five months considering the case, a federal judge has now ordered the school district to allow a transgender student to use the bathroom of his choice. That student now hoping his decision, this decision that is, will help others. I really hope that this isn't, that this doesn't benefit just me. I've always been about trying to help the community. So I really hope that something bigger than me comes out of this. For more than a year, Drew Adams was in a legal battle with the school board. That's after the school district denied the 17-year-old access to the boys' restroom because he is transgender. News 4 Jacks reporter Corley Peel spoke with Adams and his mother today, and she's live outside in East High School. And Corley, they must be thrilled with the court's ruling. They are. Drew Adams tells me that he is glad he can finally come to high school and feel like a normal kid, and he doesn't have to worry about the bathroom he can or cannot use. Drew Adams is walking into his senior year at Nice High School with confidence. Now that a federal court has ruled the St. John's County School District to allow the transgender student to use the boys' restroom. My entire high school life, I've been worried about the bathrooms. I'm very happy I can finally be a normal kid. I can worry about my college applications and my big test coming up instead of where am I going to pee. Drew has been living as a boy since 2015. Over a year ago, Adams began fighting a lawsuit against the school board after someone anonymously reported he was using the boys' restroom. Throughout that time, Adams never gave up hope. He's amazed me every day of this process. He's been strong for all of us. He's done so much more than any 17-year-old should have to do, and he's my hero, absolutely. Now that he's won the legal battle, Adams not only gets to use the boys' restroom, but can focus on getting into college. I want to be a doctor. I've always wanted to pursue something in the sciences, and just recently I kind of narrowed it down to, I want to be a psychiatrist. I want to help trans kids like me get the help that they need. He now hopes his case will open doors for other people fighting for equal rights. Adams is an honor student here at Nees High School, after graduating, he hopes to go to the University of Florida and study pre-med. Reporting live from St. John's County, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.